Welcome to your inspirational astrology horoscope for Monday, May 14th, 2012. I'm your astrologer, David Palmer, here to illuminate the collective consciousness. Here we are Monday, and that was a very big weekend. The Sun and Jupiter were conjunct. Also, we had a really strong grand trine between Mercury, Mars, and Pluto. After the weekend, I feel everybody has come into some clarity of how big their life can be. This weekend wasn't so much about amazing fortune that you actually see, like winning the lottery. It was more about the fortune of how big the picture is in your life how big and valuable that picture is. Understanding how big it is, also getting ready to move forward and how it's gonna change everything in your life. Big new goals, changing your goals. I've been talking about this for the last month, about this big grand trine. We also have another grand trine happening, but the one in Earth is all about creating that new foundation. This weekend became very clear about what that foundation is, how big it can be, and what you're gonna do to make it happen. Now today we have Mars at late eight degrees Virgo, making a pretty much perfect trine to Pluto. I've been talking about putting this action in a new lifestyle and having it change your life, change your goals, change everything in your foundation, the structure of what you're doing in your life. So today, move forward. Big changes will happen to the structure of your life and It's all about moving forward in the lifestyle that you seek. Of course, this has been tied into Mercury at that 10 degree Taurus spot, which is making us think and come up with great ideas about our stability, our big picture, and what our value is. We also have Venus and Saturn making a perfect trine as well, and Venus is at its stationary position. It's gonna click right into that 424, later today and it is going to be there there is no more moving forward with venus so venus is stopped but she is fully not asleep yet and the moon today in pisces which is making us very sensitive especially very sensitive on sunday moving into monday where we are feeling everything on a very sensitive vibe we are like um an antenna feeling every frequency in our life very magical vibe emotionally as well and this ties into all that Taurus stuff today It ties into Jupiter, the sun. We become clear, our sensitive vibration taps into how big our value can be and how special that value is. And today we appreciate sensitivity. We appreciate our intuitive side. We appreciate the God side. We appreciate the magic in our lives. And truly today is a magical day where all the pieces are in an understanding, but also the moon will square this stationary Venus later in the night and I'm looking at this as for us to double check and to not be fearful of this Venus retrograde which is new thoughts, new new analyzing of our thoughts, new questions about our value, about our relationships and a lot about our life in general and how value it is. It is um, that Libra um, Taurus vibe with Venus in Gemini so we are questioning, we are analyzing everything the stru- our value i mean we are we are qu- gonna go through this heavy questioning and of course another helicopter that is synchronicity actually that was a learjet but every time i seem to do a horoscope here there's always a jet flying over me that is some synchronicity and synchronicities are happening more and more so that's how you know you're on the right track if you haven't been seeing a lot of fortune per se It's because you need to look for the synchronicities in your life right now and follow them. We are all being guided into new directions and the more you're sitting on your old direction, the more good fortune isn't happening and the doors aren't opening since it is tied into Pluto and Capricorn. Also, you know, Taurus is all about expanding right now that foundation and expanding your stability and it's all tied into the new, it's all tied into pushing that new lifestyle that we had the retrograde. So if you're starting to see the alignment of what is going on, it is all about new, it is all about change, it is all about reflection, it is all about looking in the mirror and identifying with the changes you wanna make. And this Venus retrograde that happens tomorrow is all about new questions about the value of our life, new questions on every fabric of it, 
new questions. Of course, this is also not a time beauty wise to go do anything crazy. I wouldn't go get any implants done. I wouldn't do anything crazy with your hair or anything um, on that beauty side because Venus will be retrograde. So we got to look at that and that is tomorrow. We will talk deeply about that. But today I want you to tap into that sensitivity. Remember, the moon is in Pisces today and Pisces are the fish. It's really gilly, it's really soft. We're very sensitive fish. They hear anything in the water and boom, they already feel it, they know. This is also where we get lost. It's not so much about the direction we're going, it's about feeling the waters, feeling all the energy. And that's what today's about. And it's feeling into what happened over the weekend about that new big picture we're coming into, about pushing into that new reality, and of course about changing our goals and reaching the top of that mountain. If you don't reach the top of that mountain, you know, it's because you're still hanging out down at base camp in the old life. If you want a reading with me, this is the last week of my reading special. So go to david-palmer.com in the store, top right corner. If you're on mobile in there, you can email me and uh, send a PayPal to me as well. I'm booking up quick, so get at me this week. This is a huge week. We come into that big picture. And today, double check that Venus retrograde. Get ready to start questioning your life more than ever. I'm David Palmer. I'll see you tomorrow.